We're just about to arrive at headquarters. We never would have gotten this far without Nina. I'm really grateful to her. We're here. The fog is thick here, too. We might run into some monsters, so watch out. Well, well, it's Briscoe. So you're all right, huh? Yeah. A lot of stuff happened, but we're still alive. Good to see you're all right, too. How were things at home? The house was empty. Everybody must have escaped. But Jonesy wasn't there, either. I'm worried. Jonesy? Our pet rabbit. Oh, okay. Well, I bet your family took him with them. So what about the chief? Did you already talk to her? No, I was just about to go and when you two showed up. Good timing. Now we can go in together. Okay, fine. I guess we might as well. Good. Okay, now. Let's really let the chief have it this time. We've really got to let her know in no uncertain terms. The teams go through hell out there when we're covering the news. Especially this time. The government issued an evacuation advisory, but she sent us out anyway. A lot of our colleagues have disappeared. Some of them are even dead, like Pamela. I'd like to make that damn chief go through the same thing poor Pamela went through. Yeah, well, you know. Damn straight. And you know what else? She'd better make damn sure she doesn't go exposing any more of us employees to danger. And she'd better let the ones who are left evacuate. I'm gonna make her promise. And you, you get it all on tape, all right? That's a pretty good idea for you, Briscoe. If you get it on tape, even the chief can't try to worm her way out of it later. survivors in it. Let's check it out. Man, 
This is awful. It doesn't look like there's anybody in the driver's seat. Huh? What was that? Is there somebody in there? Paula? Oh, it's Mr. Briscoe. You're still here in the city. What about you? Didn't you evacuate either? The chief ordered us out on a report. The team and I all came together, but we got separated somehow. Yeah? We lost our reporter too. <laughs> then it's a good thing we ran into each other. I guess you're right. We're on our way to the station. Oh good, then we can all go together. I've been hearing this roaring sound around here, like some kind of wild animal. I was scared all by myself. I bet it's a monster roaming around. Let's get out of here fast. Come on, Paula, let's go. it might be there. Oh, okay. Then we'll be all right. <laughs> don't scare me like that. We don't know anything yet, though. Hey, we're almost there. Good evening to you. This is Paula Orton. Our news team went to, um, Club Gochi and met with, um, Dr. O'Connor, a biotech researcher. We learned that the cause of the tragedy now occurring in Chicago is a new bioweapon developed by the military and Zaka group. There's a vaccine that can save people from the terror of the virus. It could be located somewhere here in Grand Park Station. The question is, will we be able to find it? This is the ticket gate. There isn't anybody here. In fact, there isn't a soul anywhere around. But it's not like this is an unmanned station or anything. You're a pervert, aren't you? There's a train stopped at the platform. Let's go take a look. Looks like it might have been used for transporting some kind of animals. 
These appear to be cages, but there isn't anything in them now. A part of one of the cages is broken. Maybe the animals escaped from here. a dead body! There's a dead body here! I think she's holding something in her hand. What is it? It looks like a bottle that had chemicals in it. The bottle is broken and empty now. I wonder what was in it. There are some ingredients listed on the bottle. Sodium chloride, potassium chloride, Magnesium chloride. Hmm, it looks like they make a culture medium for the vaccine with these ingredients. Do you think we could find other things that have these ingredients in them? Like the sports drink I always have. It has something like these in it. What? Really? I think so. Anyway, they sell that drink in convenience stores. We could go take a look. Whoa! I think there was a convenience store nearby. Let's go! Ah! What is it? Just trying to kill it the usual way is a good...
guys with some TV station? Do you think you could give me a hand? I hurt my leg, and I can't get up onto the platform. Hey, what are you filming? This isn't some kind of show. Hurry up and pull me up, will you? Hey, hurry up! Come on! him do you really want to it's a special type of ammo that can be packed with the vaccine I bet we could load your pistol with it. I don't really know what you're talking about, but you mean we could shoot monsters with it? Right. But first we have to get the vaccine. Okay, let's go then. Let's hurry up and go, Mr. Briscoe. We're done with the report here, aren't we? Let's get to that convenience store. find a substitute for the culture medium at the convenience store? I don't know. I only said maybe. God damn it. Don't get mad at me. I don't see you coming up with any better ideas. I know that. That's why we're heading there right now, isn't it? <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay now. We're looking for sodium chloride, potassium chloride, and magnesium chloride, remember? I know, I know! Hey! Changing rooms. Hey, Mr. Briscoe, you don't mind, do you? Hey, you're gonna change clothes now? We're in a hurry. It'll just take a sec. 
Had to do something nice for the viewers, right? Ah! It's a dead body! <laughs> Serves you right. <laughs> Don't laugh. Who wouldn't be startled coming across something like that all of a sudden? Okay, I'm sorry. Come on, let's hurry up and find what we came for. juice, vodka, sugar... <sighs> this won't work. Ow! What was that for? 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 Caramel coloring, aspartame, caffeine, no good. Ow! What was that for? Ah! Hey! This is it! This is the one I always drink. What's in it? Think it'll work? Hmm. Let's see. Saccharide? Sodium chloride! Hey! Flavorings, amino acid, sodium citrate, calcium lactate, <gasps> potassium chloride! That's two! And magnesium chloride! Bingo! That's all three! But will this work? There's lots of other stuff in there, too. At this point, who cares? I bet it'll do the trick anyway. <sighs> I don't know. Let's go! We'll be able to make the vaccine with this and escape! Let's get to the airport! You don't want to go back to headquarters. Nah, forget about that place. Not only do we have the culture medium, but we've got tape with the truth on it, too. As long as we have those, we've got the upper hand. I don't care if we're up against the Zaka group or even the military. Hotel, why don't we take a break? I've been driving forever and I'm exhausted. Yeah, that might be a good idea. I want to take a shower too. Hey, you were having dirty thoughts just now, weren't you, Mr. Briscoe? Stop joking around. Look, we're almost there. Nobody here, huh? Well, that's all right. Nobody's gonna care if we get some rest, right? I'm going to bed. Wake me up if anything happens.
Place is creeping me out. Did you hear something? Yo! Yeah, there's something here. We don't want any more monster attacks, right? Let's just hurry up and get out of here. <laughs> ah, what's that? I'm scared, Mr. Briscoe. Uh, it's okay. Come on, let's get out of here. No, let's check it out. Over there. What? You're going? It won't open. Break it down, Mr. Briscoe. Just forget about it. Let's get to the airport. some other way. Oh, come off it. Enough already. Let's check this place out first. We can get there from here. Perfect! Don't go in there. It's too dangerous. What luck! It goes all the way to that other room. That's the owner of this hotel? It's no use. I can't go on. Hey! Is he gonna... Use. Oh my god! Yes! Why? How could I let that monster stay here? Hey, darling. Hey! You gotta hurry up and stop him! If you don't, he's gonna... Hey! Hey, are you filming? If I had refused, you would still be... I'm, I'm coming to be with you, darling. Right now, darling. Here I come. Hey! What's the matter with you? I'm gonna stop it! Obviously, didn't want to go on living. I wonder how many other people have died like this. Oh, I bet lots of innocent lives have been sacrificed like this. All in the name of security. All just to save our own skins.
almost at the airport. The military transport is gonna come get us. Time to say goodbye to this monster-infested city. Yahoo! Don't you leave without us. If you hadn't wasted so much time at that hotel... I can't do anything about that now. That's true, I guess. Anyway, we're almost there. Let's not argue anymore. Okay, fine by me. All right! This is our last report. Good luck. Thanks. Stand by. Three, two, one, go! Good evening, viewers. This is Paula Orton of Zaka TV. Um, we're here at the Great Taizu Airport in an attempt to evacuate Chicago. As you can see, the airport, just like everything else, is blanketed by thick fog. We can't see very far in front of us. Will the military transport be able to land? Let's move on to the control room. Okay, that was good. Let's go. We're now here inside the control room. There isn't anybody here. Now, we have to ask, will a military transport really be landing here to rescue civilians? <gasps> Something is coming in over the radio. I wonder who it is. that lighthouse you're right the lighthouse would the lighthouse work that would be fine okay we located it on our map now if you'll just turn on the lighthouse beacon we can land all right just hold on a while we'll go to the lighthouse right away but you've got to hurry we're running out of fuel okay let's hurry Come on! What's taking you guys so long? Let's go! Come on, get in! <laughs> Somebody's coming! Well, here you all are. It looks like we all made it in time. Is that right? In that case, you'd better hurry to the lighthouse. I'll wait here while you turn on the beacon. We'll meet up again after that. I'll have a talk with General Sanders to be sure all of you will be allowed onto the transport. Hey! 
Chief! Run! The Chief! Pamela took her! Chief? Chief! It doesn't matter now. Come on, let's go. Finally, real people, at last! I have no idea what's going on. Where did all this fog come from? We don't have any time to waste on this guy. We've got to get to the lighthouse. Wait, don't go! <laughs> Who is it? I've been so lonely all by myself. Don't leave me. <laughs> this guy is looking really sick. I bet he's infected with that virus. Virus? What are you talking about? I don't have a cold or anything. Tell me you're Dr. O'Connor's guinea pig. What? You know Dr. O'Connor too? Where is he? That Dr. O'Connor is so mean. Poking and prodding a guy's body like he was nothing. And when I woke up, he was gone too. He left me all alone. What the heck is going on? Hey, you guys! Get Dr. O'Connor to come back! No! Wait a minute! Don't go! Wait! <laughs> Look! Over there! Do you see that? Come on! I'll race you! is nuts! What do you want to do? Hey! There's something wrong with him. I bet he's already turned into a monster. <laughs> Where's Dr. O'Connor? Dr. O'Connor!
It's clearing away! That guy? He was what was causing everything? Where is that transport? I don't see it anywhere! Come on, let's just get to the lighthouse. This is the lighthouse. Phew! Boy, I'm really tired. Say, Mr. Briscoe, you guys do the rest. That's enough reporting. Why? What's the matter? I've had it. Why do we have to be put into this kind of danger just to do the news? All I wanted was to do some serious reporting. Get a little famous, have everybody tell me how great I was, and marry a handsome Hollywood star. That wasn't so much to ask, was it? Now I'm all dirty and I've seen all these dead bodies and monsters. I've had it up to here. Calm down. It's our duty to record the truth about what's happening. Somebody's gonna watch the videotapes we've been making and see the truth. See everything that's been happening to us. Who cares? I don't give a damn about that. I'm not budging one inch from this spot. All right, if that's the way you feel. It's too bad, though. Come on, let's go! So this is the lighthouse, huh? <sighs> Looks like it's just you and me now. Well, let's get this taken care of. Hey, what do you think of Paula? You know what I think? I think that reporter knows who's behind all this stuff that's been going on. That one's the chief's favorite, after all. Yeah, and that damn chief! She was the one that forced us all into this whole mess from the start! Goddamn chief! The next time I see her, I swear, I'm gonna... Oops. I forgot you were getting this on camera. You'll edit that part out, won't you? Man, that guy they were experimenting on. Do you think he was what was causing the fog? And what was up with that plane that crashed into Lake Michigan? I just don't know. This must be it. This is the power supply to the lighthouse. to the top. All these deaths we've seen. Everything's all confused in my head now. I get this feeling some of these murders didn't have anything to do with the virus at all. I guess I've probably just about got the whole thing figured out. Hey! What do you think? Who do you think's behind all of this stuff? Now's your chance. This is your opportunity to let everybody know exactly what you think. Well, how about it? Hmm, won't talk with the camera on, hey? 
Ha! Coward! The fog's completely cleared away! I don't see that transport anywhere, though. It looks like they deserted us. <laughs> but who cares if they don't rescue us now? Without that fog, there won't be any monsters. We can go anywhere we want. <sighs> I don't know why, but I feel so tired. I'm not feeling very good all of a sudden. It can't be! Hello viewers, this is Andy Steamboat, Zonka TV cameraman. I've just lived through some pretty terrifying experiences, but the real horror is just about to begin. All of you watching this right now, I firmly believe you have the right to know the truth. That's... Alright, man! This is great! Not the usual board work today! It's a secret photo shoot! Wow! Come to think of it, it's already been five years since I started doing this kind of work! I'm all standing behind the camera, holding up on my feet that here and there! A big fire over here! A big heist over there! I take my life into my hand and jump into all kinds of dangerous situations. Sometimes I barely escape by the skin of my teeth. But does my pay ever go up? No way! And look what they got me into this time! Straight monsters wandering all over town! I've been barely escaping with my life, and nobody ever comes to help. I want my life back, my youth. But now, finally, at last, the 
much time for my big reward is finally here! <laughs> Oops! Can't let myself get too carried away! The photo shoot is just about to begin! The main thing I want to know is who is the model? You're gonna be the model? Don't you wanna take my picture? It's kind of weird. Oh well, whatever. Okay, let's get this thing started. Is it turned out okay? All right, I guess it's time to pack up then. <laughs> <laughs> 